Speaker 13, Chris Rawl. Good afternoon. My name is Chris Rawl. My last name is spelled R-A-L-L. -L. I'm with Transportation for America. We are a diverse coalition of about 450 organizations fighting for true transportation reform that helps our nation realize a bold new vision of the 21st century transportation system that is safer, cleaner, smarter, and provides more options for everyone. These fare increases, cuts to service, and layoffs are moving us in the exact opposite direction from that vision. Additionally, they have had an impact on many people's access to jobs and services, thus negatively impacting our families. This is happening all over the country. A recent survey by uh, APTA, the American Public Transit Association, as uh, Fred Hansen mentioned, uh, came back with uh, nearly 85% of agencies undergoing some combination of service cuts, fare increases, and job cuts. Our organization, T for America, um, uh, released a map yesterday that shows just how widespread this problem is. And if anyone would like a copy, I'd be happy to give you one. Um, the survey I mentioned and this map tell a story that this is a national problem and we need a national solution. Fortunately, there are potential solutions on the horizon, or at least things that can help somewhat. Um, a transit operations bill um, in the Senate, Senate Bill 3189, introduced by Ohio Senator uh, Sherrod Brown and co-sponsored by Oregon Senator Ron Wyden, uh, would give transit agencies the flexibility to use federal funds where they're most needed whether it's for operating assistance or for capital investments. This could save transit jobs, prevent fare increases, and preserve mass transit service communities across the country. 82% um, of voters uh, believe the United States would benefit from expanded and improved transportation system, including modes of transportation like rail and buses. We found that in a survey that we recently did, a nationwide survey. And studies show that investment in transit is an effective job creation strategy, creating 23,000 jobs uh, per billion dollars invested and ensuring additional workers access to their jobs so they can keep working. We hope you'll join our campaign and address this crisis in a, um, to the comprehensive. We hope you'll join our campaign and address this crisis on the way to comprehensive uh, reform of our federal transportation policy. <coughs> You can go to T4, that's the letter T and the number 4, america.org, or come and ask me how you can get involved. And thank you to everyone here uh, who cares so much about our transit service and to try and for their hard work in this really difficult situation. And uh, good luck um, uh, really to the whole community in trying to figure out how to make these decisions about um, how to balance the budget. Thank you. Thank you.